Hello and welcome back. So, uh, last time we officially took down the Nazis. We are no longer the Nazi Reich. We're now the German military junta, which is a, what do you call it, non-aligned faction run by von Mackenstein. But I believe it's going to be changing as of the end of this. Non-aligned party, yeah, will now be called Deutsche National Volkspartil. I don't know what that means, but I believe Volk means people. Deutsch is German, so it's German... German National People's Party, maybe, is the closest thing I can think of what it looks like, but that could be incorrect. It sounds weird for a Kaiser, but okay. Whatever. Oh, we get daily stability. Oh, we get stability 10% and less fascism. Okay. Won't be useful later, but for now, I'll definitely take the 10% stability. So there's 11 troops. Let's just outright pump out more. We can just change their templates later if we want them to be something else. For now, we just need to keep pumping men out. I'm trying to build up our forces because we got pretty cut down in that last engagement. Yeah, the real problem is the Democrats and the Communists. They're both, like, collectively, I think they make the majority now. So, Return of the Kaiser can't happen until we have 40% for that, but we can go factory repair speed, but more importantly, negative 20% consumer goods. Now, I would actually say before we do that, we'd be better off doing this and the next one so that we get the, what is it, like, two, four, six factories, so it'd be 12 factories in total, then we'll lower our consumer goods good stuff so that those 12 factories can immediately go into actually building things, which would be useful. So this purifier power. Light aircraft designer so we can keep getting good fighters. Oh yeah, and I should have... Oh no, I can't, can I? Because I'm not fascist or communist, so I can't actually go war economy. That kind of sucks. We're going to do this one, because I want the... I want to see what's going on around the world, because it seems like... Did they leave the Allies, or did they just stop being puppets? They did leave the Allies. In fact, the Allies disbanded. Now is the Commonwealth of Nations, which includes all of the ex-Dominions, except for India, who is a free country. Interesting. What about Malaya? Malaya is the only puppet of the United Kingdom left. All the others have left them. That's really weird. Ah, oh, yeah, he's doing the King's Party right now. So he is going on a line. He's bringing the King in. Fascinating. I don't know how that's going to go for him. I feel like that was probably the worst choice. Some of the alternate paths for Britain are really powerful, but that one, eh. I don't think the AI do well with it. It is a fun one, though. That's the path where if you play your cards right, you can actually... Because Wallace Simpson was an American... Once Britain takes over America under that path, you can actually re-establish America as a monarchy and have your wife, Wallace Simpson, be the Queen of America. Which I thought was hilarious when I first found out that that was an option. Okay, so now I can build more and we've got more, so we're gonna go... More sieves, even though it's still 37. We do need more military factories, but for now, we'll do this. Probably going to get rid of the light tanks too, because I don't think we're really going to be using them. I'm just going to alter everyone into infantry for now. Put the light tanks into stockpile, we'll see what we can do with them later. And inventory design, yeah, we're going to need some more equipment. Oh, those 18 divisions are out already, so... 20, 1, 2, 2, 3, 24, that's the first army finished. And we'll just pump out... Oh, we can do another army, and that'll give us three armies. Which is decent. Yeah, empowerment of the King's Party. Looks like monarchs are back on the menu. King Edward VIII. Pakistan declared war on India, so it's just broken free. Oh, and Bangladesh is part of Pakistan right now. If I just...
Yeah, it's got the foreign claim of Bangladesh, which I think spawns later. As long as Pakistan doesn't win that war, which basically I think is impossible because I think factory and unit counts. It's mostly to do with factories. I'll tell you what, they actually start with a decent amount of divisions. If, if someone was to actually send volunteers and support them and you had good divisions, you could probably help Pakistan win that. But it doesn't matter. They, nine times out of ten, don't win. If they do win, it'll just be interesting. Nothing special. Raider fleet, yes, we'll probably build some submarines soon. I want to get the extra research slot and then we'll go back over to the Kaiser stuff. Because research slots are always important. Oh yeah, and look at that, we can get the Kaiser now. So once we get him back, we'll be well on a roll. We'll get this one first, so that'll let us build up faster. Then we'll get the Kaiser. Uh, what else? Yeah, most of that's to do with the Red Menace, which we will deal with, but not yet. This game's going to be very different and probably easier, depending on what happens with Britain. I don't know, I think in that tree it can get its dominions back. It's just that it's not going to start with them and that's going to really hurt them. Yeah, don't do artillery as it takes too long, do these two instead. Start building artillery here. Yeah, put more factories into that. Even if we have to take some off of guns for now. Jeez, it's September already. This year just flew behind the game. This video is going to be over real quick. Shanxi was puppeted. So I take it China. Yep, China has not formed. Chinese Defense Pact, which is probably really bad for them, because one-on-one -on -one Japan will kick their ass. I think we'll go research slot first, so they're doing that. Yep, continue down the doctrines. Over here, give me this one so we can start building, and then we'll get the Kaiser. Army Logistics. That'll help us out in the east. Um, right. What's going on in Spain? Kind of divided, I don't actually know who's going to win that. Yep, construction level 3, is it? Could do those at 300 days, I'll probably do this one for the fuel refining. Get some extra fuel and stockpiles. So the fact that there's no Great Britain really does help us. Well, there is a Great Britain, but there's no, like, allies. Is the Commonwealth of Nations, so all the minor nations are together without India. This is actually working out really good for me. This is, you know, it couldn't have gone much better, really. Alright, so we got 29 divisions, so they should be in two groups. The U5 go there, which joins the entire army, joins here. Give them a commander. And that entire army will join there as well. Give them a commander. You know, we'll do another one. We don't really need it yet, but we'll do it anyway, just to put them out in the field. And then that should be more than enough forces. We'll get a hard attack on tanks when we start building those. On heavy tanks, that is. So if we build the nation... Do we get construction speed there? We do. Yeah, let's get the Kaiser anyway. See, so yeah, we're flying through this, which is good. Let's build a little bit more. I know that's a lot. I don't know if I'll finish all of them. I might cancel some, but that's... If they build them all, that'll give us a huge foundation. Foundation for our new empire. Also, Pact of Rome... Oh, so it's not actually a faction. They just signed off for like an agreement thing. So what is Hungary doing? Because I'm pretty sure they were the ones that did this. Hungary is guaranteeing the independence of Austria. What are they doing? So we could go weapons too, start producing those bright and early. Let's get some logistics. Start working on our encryption and decryption. Decryption first. And it's 1938. So thank you for coming by, people. I appreciate it. Like, comment, and subscribe. Tell me how you think. Tell me what you want to see next, because 
I've got a thousand ideas for this game and I will get into mods. First, I want to sort of explore the base game and what you can do with it. Then we'll start going into mods. I definitely want to touch like Kaiser Reich. I want to do especially Old World Blues series. There's a few that I want to do. But yeah, comment what you want to see. Drop us a like. Come back for the next video. I'll see you all next time. Bye for now.